and welcome to the Audio Power Baristas weekly vlog number 70 where I talk about audio, coffee and other things that keep me busy. Got some very nice things for you today but first let's play some music, let's make some coffee. Let's start with the music. Here's something you have not seen before, I'll tell you all about it later. So, over here I have two boxes and I don't know if you have ever heard of Neukom. It is uh, high-end audio systems from Switzerland, Swiss Precision. And the CD player you just heard is from Neukom. I picked this up for a very nice price um, this week. And on top here, I got my first fan mail. Now I already opened it because there's all kind of personal information on the top. I did not go into the um, what is in there. And I'm going to make a separate video of it because I want to give the first fan mail that I got the respect that it deserves. So watch out for that video. But this Neukom is what you just heard and it is this little beautiful cd player this is the cd 33 and i like the minimalistic design on it and last week i told you i would like to see if i can get some spare equipment for when i have equipment visiting to review or for other purposes i don't have to um, dismantle all the stuff that i have here or downstairs but have a spare but so i found this one for a very low price and i know price is of course relative i picked this up for just over 200 bucks but remember this when it came out was way over 2000 bucks so that's a pretty good steel. It looks, it still looks beautiful and immaculate. So I'm very happy with it. And the only problem I have is that first impressions think this may be so good that I want to integrate it into my uh, main system and still not have a spare part. But anyways, I'm listening to it and I'm enjoying it. And unfortunately, um, I cannot do it on my main system because I told you last week my main system is out of order because they need to be repaired. Something to say about that in a minute. So for now I am playing the Wilsonton again. It has the KT88 uh, tubes and it is playing in tryout mode for this. And as you just saw I am playing the 
98 dB sensitivity oscillators right over here. So what I said is that my main system, the two OTL mono amplifiers plus the preamplifier has to go to uh, for repairs. Now this set is about 30 years old. It is made and designed by a Dutch guy and I am still having this equipment in service with him, the one who designed it and build it nobody knows more about this equipment than he does so i was thinking because of the channel why not ask him if he would like to do uh, something like an interview or at least tell something about his design philosophy and how he made these things so i called him i told him i need some repairs but i have another question and he agreed we have to look at what way we are going to do it but he agreed to do an interview or at a minimum do a comprehensive uh, review of his own uh, equipment. Now, just like me, he is not the guy who likes to be in front of the camera. So we will find out in what way we are going to do it, but we are going to do it. And before that, I will make a little video about the equipment again. And in that video, I will ask you to uh, send in questions if you have any. So that's something that is uh, going to happen. And the song you just listened to is the CD that I've been playing lately because YouTube does not flag it. It's um, a demo, not mixed. And I think through this system it sounds very, very nice. Um, but especially I like the fact that I have this nice little CD player. So I connected it with the Oyaide uh, cable. It is only a coaxial out and analog out and an input for power. And that's it. The uh, form factor is smaller than most. You see, if I can put those together, you see it is even smaller than the Wilsonton because this is a small. I am having an option on the matching uh, integrated amplifier because I think these things look absolutely stunning. So I'll probably doing a review, but I'll probably also, when my main system is uh, back online, I'm going to see, okay, so I have this CD player, I have the Quad CD player, I have an Arcam CD player, and I have the Oppo Blu-ray player over there. And let's see out of those four, which one I like most. And of course, I have the PS Audio DA converter, and let's see how this works on that um, DA converter when using this one as a transport. But um, this thing is just beautiful. It has, of course, as many um, when you the tray when you put it out, it has a little bit of this plasticky feeling like you have in many um, CD players, especially, especially the ones who are less expensive. But if you listen when it is inside, once it is inside, it's more or less quiet. So I love this thing. Another thing that I want to talk about is yesterday, a friend of mine, he is, a, he is a carpenter and he, every now and then I'm going to visit him in his workshop. And yesterday when I visited him, the thing was, um, oh, let's drink some coffee. The thing was when I came in to look him up, he was at his first day starting 
at building a big cabinet with drawers for records. So I asked him, well, can we do some pictures and videos during the whole process of designing it and delivering it and seeing how it works? And he was okay with that. So somewhere in the future, I don't know how long it will take him to make this thing, but um, I think it's going to look beautiful. And I think it's going to be very interesting to see on the channel how a dedicated um, rack for LPs, not open, but with beautiful drawers. Um, so that's also one thing that's coming up. So there's all kinds of things coming up. And the first one probably will be the unboxing of my first fan mail box. So that's all I have for you today. I need to get back to work. I'm hoping you're all safe, having a good day and probably see you tomorrow. But for the vlog, the weekly vlog, I will see you next week.